The next thing I'm going to show you is the track icons. For the four different types of tracks, there's four different types of icons. So we're going to go in and look at them each. The first one is the, the master. The master has this type of icon right here. It's a little bit different than the rest of them. It basically just allows you to look at it and just know that this is a master track that controls whatever I've assigned to it. This one particularly controls analog one two. So the analog one two is going to be controlled by this master fader. So everything that goes out to it is you can turn down and turn up with this one fader. The next one is an auxiliary track. Auxiliary tracks tracks can be sent into auxiliary tracks to run through them. That's why they have this little down arrow. The next one is an audio file track, and this one has waveforms that you can, you know, that you can record onto and you can edit within there. The last one is a MIDI track. A MIDI track you can record MIDI data and it's being um, signaled out to maybe a machine or something else, some type of sound generator. You can't, you can't put any type of effects on MIDI tracks right now, but you can always bounce down the MIDI tracks and add effects after.